Hey, Susan Berkeley with you for the Inside Voice of Her Video training blog. And this week, during our holiday week, we're going to start thinking ahead to the new year and how your voice of her career is going to look in the next year. We want to do a little bit of holiday planning so that things go smoothly as we turn the corner into January. So the first thing that I always like to do at the end of the year, I like to have some time for reflection. So if I'm starting a new venture, I want to get really clear about why I'm doing this. So that's what I'm going to challenge you to do. Take out a pad of paper and just brainstorm about why you want to do your voiceover career and make it a good enough reason and that will see you through for 2018. The next is to budget the time. Now, starting any new venture is going to take some time, so you want to make sure that you look at your schedule, and this is going to work best for you if you do your voiceover activities at the same time every day, whether it's early in the morning or at lunchtime. Budgeting the time, setting it on your calendar will really, really help. The next is to budget some money. Now, it does take some money to invest to get started in this career, just like in any business. But the great news is you're not buying a lot of equipment. You're not, you don't have staff. You can do this from home. So I would say, you know, a few extra hundred, even if you have up to $1,000 or two to set aside for this, that's great. But start saving, budget that money because you can't start a business without it. And then finally is to take one outrageous risk. So I wanna share a story with you to close. There was a guy, he was a salesman, and he had a British accent. He was working in the United States, and he decided, you know, he thought it would be really, really cool if he could be the voice of Lexus. So being a great salesperson, he was terrific with cold calling, he managed to get through to the CEO of Lexus and convince the guy that he should be their voice. <laughs> Talk about an outrageous risk. Well, the CEO was so impressed, he immediately called the advertising agency and told them they needed to put that guy on the air. So he did. It was his entry to voiceover at a very, very high level. He made a ton of money. That's what I mean about an outrageous risk. So something to think about. Happy New Year. We will see you in the new year with more Inside VoiceOver.